Hello guys and welcome to today's video where we are on the ground at London South End and today we're off to Cornwall on the Surf Shuttle it's a sort of two part video where we start off at South End, we head down to Cornwall and we fly back pretty much we're uh, obviously on the ground at London South End, there's, we're on Vatsin, there's no ATC online, it's early in the morning and uh, there's not much on around the UK area to be precise so we'll go into the cockpit now, we'll start setting up and uh, yeah we'll start setting up so we'll go down into the second FMC or MCDU and today we will be running with the checklists on cockpit preparation checklist and we'll open the doors batteries both on whilst we can power. as well external power is on navigation lights and we'll also set on engine master turn the displays on engine mode selector checked normal landing gear lever checked parking brake off flaps checked position speed brake lever look up your check checked thrust levers idle transponder mode checked standby radio control panel set on it can recall checked anti skid on. Flight director. On. Emergency so lights. Quiet now. I thought it was a list. No smoking signs. Set on. Anti ice. Off. Probe window heat. Auto. Air condition. Checked. Ventilation panel. Is checked. Electric panel. Checked. Fuel pumps. Set on. Hydraulics. Is checked. Accubrate pressure. Checked. Ground proximity warning system. Right, so Echo Golf Hotel on. Q Electronic flight control system. That's the ICAO for Nuki. Today we are easy. Six five two. Set to now. And cost index Emergency today. Equipment. Of six is checked. Cruising checked. today, it will be even. We're going for level. 180 for today's cruise. We'll align the IRS and we'll get the fuel panel up. And just while the IRSs are aligning, uh, and then we will be back after they're all aligned and then we'll be ready to fill out the rest of the FMC. So then, uh, I've just found out the fuel and block fuel. We'll put all that in. Uh, the catering service is complete. We'll just see if we can request boarding now, which we have done. And it is runway 06 departing out of South End today. We'll insert that, put that across, and then it should be straight off to Southampton, which is in. That's fine. There you go. Southampton to L620, Lima 620. So we'll go Southampton, oh god, wrong one, Air Lima 620, my bad. Southampton, Airways, Lima 620. Stick that in. The next airway will be UN 514. UN 514. And then we're off to Diddle, D-I, oh god, D-I-D-E-L, Diddle. And then we'll insert that. And we are not very heavy today, so we'll only go flaps one out of South End. 62 is the flex temp, and then we're done with our flight planning software, so that can be closed down, which is brilliant. So, if we go to a quick outside view, the uh, boarding should be starting very shortly. The uh, EasyJet Airbus A320, we're not flying their new repaint or their new li livery today. We're just uh, staying with the old one. It's just the uh, bog standard livery today and uh, it's Easter so the summer schedules are starting so actually in real life at South End this flight will start operating now obviously because of the summer schedules and stuff so everything is good I suppose so the passengers are boarding, IRS is still aligning and uh, we will be back when everything is complete so hello guys we're uh, just turning APU on, we're ready for pushback Uh, so yeah, sorry, we're just uh, commencing our before start checklist, the APU is just turning on, all the uh, GSX is in place and we'll be ready very very shortly. And we'll be pushing back with a nose right tower left, departing runway 06 out of South End. Before after noise abatement we'll be making a left hand turn, 
yeah, left hand turn and uh, then we'll be heading to Southampton so all is good everything does seem okay so the Set APU's on, on. External power. disconnected and off Kevin signs. Set on. Trust levers. Idle. Parking brake. So we've put the Set cruise on. altitude in straight away. We'll be heading straight Check. up to the cruising altitude. One, no zero, delay. One zero. One zero one zero. Check. Beacon lights. Set on. Checklist complete. Flight deck. So here we go. Go ahead, sir. Ground. We have ATC clearance for start and taxi now. Please confirm ground equipment and services are clear. So GSX now will be uh, connecting the tug. Roger. You're off on the trucks today, Captain, so your ground equipment and stairs are clear and all doors are closed. Ready when you are. Brilliant. So... Okay. Now we've just got to wait for GSX to do its thing. As we come to a view... Here you can see the GSX tug just get connected. <clears throat> so here we go then, it'll just tell us to release the parking brakes in a second. So release the parking brake. Here we go. Commencing our pushback now. Now the pushback here at South End is very, very short. Um, so straight away we'll start number two. And uh, straight away here you'll see that sort of left hand. Well, no, the uh, sort of turn very, very shortly as you can roughly make out. Uh, so here we go then. We're commencing our pushback now. Out of the gate at South End. Obviously, this isn't what South End is like now. It's uh, all this no one, no aircraft really parks over here. It's all over the uh, other side, over there. The runway two four is, but uh, we won't be going down there. To be honest, right. Wait for number engine two stabilised, and then we'll start number one. Engine two is stabilised. Starting number one. So there we go, it's starting number one now, so both engines are coming on. And to a wing view here. You have to roughly make out the engine starting. Which really isn't working too good to be honest. <laughs> so it is quite a short taxi out to runway 06. Um, there we go. So there we go. Uh, all should be done. Engine one is stabilized. Set the parking brakes. That's a good start on both engines. All systems are normal. Thanks for your help and all clear. We we'll see you for the signal on the right, please. Roger, two good starts. All clear signal. See you on the right. There we go. We'll wait now. Just wait for a minute. Unlocking the gear, unlock it after the start, here we go. Engine roll selector. Set. APU bleed. Set off. APU master. Set off. Ground spoilers. Set. So here we go. Check zero. Pitch trip. Set. Side controls. Just put my rudder pedals in the middle there. Right, it's full left. Full left. Full right. Full right. Neutral. Neutral. Full up. Full down. Neutral. Neutral. Rudder. Full left. Full right. Neutral. Check. Flaps. Flaps one. Anti ice. Off. Flaps one. Beacon status. Checked. Beacon door page. Checked. And signal. Received. Received. Checklist complete. So we'll uh, release the parking brakes now and we'll 
just start our taxi up to about 10 knots. Taxiing checklist. No flight. Set on. Brake check. Pedal press. Check zero. The brake check on here is so OP. Auto brakes. Max. Take off data. Reviewed. FCU. Checked. Flight instruments. Checked. Checked. TO config. Set. Checklist complete. So we will require the whole runway today. So we have to backtrack and uh, proceed on from there. Start the before takeoff checklist. Flight attendant seats for takeoff. Before takeoff checklist. Brake temperature. Checked. Brake fans. Off. Engine mode selector. Check normal. TCAS. TARA tilt above. Exterior lights. Set on. Sliding tables. Stowed. Stowed. Checklist complete. So then that's the before takeoff checklist complete, so we'll be able to depart now straight away after our backtrack and turn. We're going to uh, taxi all the way down here, or the backtrack all the way down to uh, the end of the runway here. Obviously you could tell there's a bit of a sort of curvature so we can make our turn. It's always is a tight turn this, always is. Aim is not to touch the ground, or the grass, sorry. We're not actually on the grass, you will be surprised. Perfect. You cannot teach that. Brilliant. <clears throat> so there we go, that's fine now. Let's go, take off. Take off. Man, Toga, SRS and runway. Power set. 100 knots. Checked. Rotate. Positive plan. Gear up. Gear up. Navigation. Check. So we're going to fly the noise abatement procedure now. Autopilot on. Autopilot on. Climb thrust. Climb thrust. Bye bye, South Lights End. Off. Exterior lights. Set off. Tax. Both on. Empty eyes. Off. Decas. Checked. Quality meter. One zero one. One zero one zero. Check. Check is complete. So there we go then. Our next stop, Cornwall. So guys, we'll be back for our final approach. We're just passing 5,000 feet now, so we'll be back for our final approach into Cornwall. We'll see you very, very shortly. Hello guys, and welcome to our very, very, very turbulent approach into Cornwall. Checked. Standard. Just passing flight level 70, going through some really heavy cloud, and the turbulence is absolutely awful. Um, really is not what I was expected. But the, uh, it's been worse than this uh, before we actually initiated our descent we had to climb up to flight level 200 to try and get out of the turbulence and uh, just it's been a really really bouncy flight and obviously there's bad weather coming across the UK today and there was a winds up we winds at the cruise are about 120 knot crosswind so we now just got to be really careful here because we just need to judge our approach as a transition altitude
Barrow reference set and cross checked. One zero one four. One zero one four. Check. So it's about to pass five thousand feet. Right, I've got to go down to two thousand on the altitude. Fourteen nautical miles before we establish. We'll go two three zero on speed. Uh, yeah, not bad. Yeah, we'll go two three zero now on the speed. And we'll go down to two thousand feet. Actually no, we'll go two thousand five hundred for the time being. So sort of turbulent and bouncy approach. Okay, then we'll now reduce speed to to ten knots. <clears throat> so we'll turn off the terrain now. Uh, don't really require it on a little bit of cloud in front of us and uh, our turn is in about 10 nautical miles go around flaps what um Uh, okay, well, apparently we're going around. We're not. <laughs> so, um, we're going down on vertical speed. 1,600 we'll go down on. And uh, descending 2,500 feet. Speed back now, 180 knots. I don't understand why to go around when active there. Oh well. Okay then, so what we'll do now is we'll maintain this heading uh, 240, speed back now 160 knots. And also we'll decrease the vertical speed to 1200. And oh no, we'll decrease now to 600 on the vertical speed. And we'll lose speed brakes. Yet again, the visibility is being our best friend. Swaps one. Okay then. Have we crew seats for landing? Positive climb. Gear up. What? Gear up. Okay. Well, I'm just going to turn them off because that's just, you know, you bowled on us. There we go. Right, then we'll engage via our localizer and we'll put altitude down to 2,000 feet. Heading now 250 degrees, speed back 150 knots. Okay, then speed 140 now. Performance in it. The final approach speed is. The final approach speed is. find that approach speed is 138. So we'll go flaps 2.
heading 255 picked up the glide path 260 now on the heading that should be our establish should be about 138 looking for the field there's the field just in front of us there Okay then, gear down, flaps free, arms through brakes, flaps full, engage approach, select command B, okay then, field in sight, go around the altitude, it's in, it's heading on the glide path, the runway, oh God. runway 30 at Newquay, Everything seems okay. The bang on profile. One thousand. One thousand feet. The runway is starting to look quite short. Should be fine though for an A320. Sweaty palms. Squeaky bum time now guys, here we go. Landing. Three red, one white. A little bit low, but yeah, hopefully the autopilot can correct that. Feet on the pedals, two red, two white on the puppies for bang on profile. Landing. Here we go. Osteopilot off. Aircraft is mine. I have Five control. Hundred. 500 feet. Hundred above. 400. Minimum. Landing. 300. 200 100 70 60 50 40 30 20 retard 10 5 we're down First green. Cancel reverse. And your brakes. Next question is, where do people actually park at Nuki? Okay then. Vacate here. This control tower. Smashing. So there we go then guys, welcome to Nuki. It's quite windy, but you know, that's Nuki. And this is off to park over here.
Boom. There we go. Shut down the engines. Should be running on APU. Beacons can come off. Right then, so there we go. The parking's too small for the uh, aircraft apparently, so, you know, we will all have to suffer. The parking was awful, you know. Anyways, there we go then guys, we've arrived successfully at Cornwall. Um, part one of two of the surf shuttle flight from Southland to Cornwall. The, auto, uh, the checklist mucked up a bit on the approach, but you know. That's uh, to be expected when you're flying like that. So a massive thank you guys. I do apologise for the break, but it's now the Easter holidays, so there's going to be a lot more content coming out. Streaming is also coming back. The flight sim is fixed. So guys, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Check out all the stuff below, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. I'd Fever Zane. Bye-bye.